Hey, it's Mike. I'm going to talk today about putting my ornate box turtles in hibernation. It's now November, and typically at the end of November, I want them in hibernation. Uh, most box turtles will hibernate between November and March. Typically, they don't come out of hibernation until the air temperature comes around 70 to 80 degrees. So, right now, they're sleeping in their log. And what I'm going to do in a couple days is I'm going to put them in their little bedding area and I'm going to bury them so they feel secure. Right now I have a UVB light on. I have this one in the center which is a heat element and a UVB lamp. On the end this is a UVB lamp and a heat lamp. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to shut this one off today and it's going to keep it a little colder. Right now the temperature has been consistently 60 degrees at night or lower. And that's what's going to send them in the hibernation if you have those kind of temperatures consistently at night or during the day. So this is something you really want to do with ornate box turtles. Every year I put these little guys into, uh, little girls I should say, in the hibernation and it's part of their life. They're going to live longer, they're going to be happier and healthier and it's something you have to do. Now if you don't have the option of an indoor pin and maybe you have an outdoor pin maybe they're going to naturally dig down in the dirt sometimes they'll dig down six or seven inches in the dirt sometimes they're just going to bury themselves under a pile of leaves something to make them feel safe and secure you don't want them just out in the open you want them under something so if you have ornate box turtles you need to start thinking about hibernation if they haven't already gone into hibernation they're going to start moving slower which might have one of them um, has not come out at all the other one just now and again so the plan is this is kind of step one turn the light off so it remains consistently colder in there and then about three or four days i'm going to shut this lamp off so it's only a uvb lamp so after that what i'm going to do is i'll probably take everything else out of here and i'll just leave some water and maybe a little food dish or some dry food just in case they they get up and wander up so this is step one and I'll get back to you guys when I do uh, my next step, kind of cleaning up the pen and I'll show you, I'll put them in the bedding area in our barium, but I don't want to do too fast. I want to do it slowly. So it's hibernation time.